You know guys, as I finish packing up things on this beautiful fall day, even though the fish didn't cooperate, I got to see a lot of beautiful things. On the way in, I saw a pretty good buck. Saw an osprey's nest. Saw a couple of beavers. Lots of ducks. Got me thinking about all the strains and things I've seen out on the water. Some days it's not all about catching fish. Some days it's just about the experience. Today I'm gonna tell you about the strangest thing I've seen on the water. Back when I first started fishing out of a John boat, I had a pretty decent 2D sonar, which is about the best technology there was then. Fishing lake I fished a good many times, and all of a sudden my graph just blacked out. I didn't really know what it was, I hadn't seen it there before. Stuck my rod down in the water, I could feel the top of it. I knew it was hard and slick, but I really had no idea what it was. Then late last year, stepped up to the Helix unit with side images. That thing had always been stuck in my head. With this technology, I got to find out what it was. I go around and scan it, felt pretty positive about what it was, but I wanted to be 100% sure. So maybe after about three or four trips out scanning, looking at this object in the water, trying to figure out exactly what it was, I came up with an idea. I decided to take a magnet, tie it on the end of my rod, see if it stuck. Then I know if it was a rock or if it was a vehicle like I was thinking. Well, the magnet did stick. Pretty much solidified my idea that it was a car that I had found in the lake. Not sure exactly what to do. Called the non-emergency number, my local police department, and explained to them what I found. To be honest, to start with, they were pretty confused. They didn't know exactly how to take it, and I didn't know exactly what to tell them. And let me tell you, when the cops showed up and I showed them the picture of the image off of my graph, you can only imagine what it was like trying to explain what they were looking at. I had both a side view image and a pretty clear down view image of the car on the bottom. They got in touch with DNR, sent out a robot that had both video and sonar capabilities. They did find the car with the sonar, but visibility was where you couldn't see it on the video. So the next day I returned, they brought out a dive team and sent divers down to check out the vehicle before they pulled it out. Thankfully, there was nobody in the vehicle. They brought out a big military transport vehicle, a big armored unit, and pulled the car out. Come to find out it had been stolen in 1998 from a town nearby and dumped into the lake where I found it. Now I'll show you a few images of the vehicle after they pulled it out. Compared to what I saw on my Hummingbird Helix unit. Y'all let me know what the strangest thing you've ever found on the lake. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Till next time, this is Decked Out.